Now back to yard sale finds for for the spring that we've just gone through. Went to a yard sale, asked them if they had any video games, started listing stuff off, and they said, yes, we've got we've got some Wii stuff that we're getting rid of. And they brought out boxes of Wii stuff. Now, I kept so much, and I sold the rest, obviously, to pay for it. But to start off, we've got a a bit dirty, but a, a good condition. Well, not good condition. The, uh, the end of it's all broken. Still works, though. I have used it. Numchuck. Always a good find. We've also got a uh, Wii Motion Plus Black Wii Mote. Great find, and a blue one. Don't see many of those. It's also Wii Motion Plus. Great to have. We've got the the black console, the black Wii console, a later generation one, but still good. No Game Boy or GameCube, sorry, GameCube uh, ports or anything on top. But still, a great thing to add to the collection. Then the games. Like I said, there were probably 50 games that came out. This, this, and I asked them, what do you want for the bundle? And they said, I think, $40. And I said, all right, I'll give you $40. And I, I know I paid $40. I just don't remember if I, if I bartered with them at all. So all of these games were in with that bundle. Except for this. We did pick up a copy of Twilight Princess for six dollars. It's complete in box. Everything's there. We picked up a copy of Twilight Princess for the Wii, complete in box, both manuals, French and English. Very nice to have. Very good condition. A lot better than the one I have, so I will be selling the one I have. But I will show you that one as well. Actually, I might keep the one I have because that's a Nintendo Select. Okay, first off, let's we've got the other copy of Twilight Princess. No manual, disc is in good shape, but a lot of staining on the the outside. Must have got very wet once. But it's a good game to have. Like I said, might might just get rid of that one and keep the Nintendo Select. We got a copy of Super Mario Bros. Wii. A must must have for the Wii. We've got a copy of Super Smash Brawl. Once again, label is a bit dirty, very sun faded up here in this corner, stained, but disc is in great shape, complete in box, so not going to complain for something that was free. And we've got this copy of Wii Sports in a, uh, with a, a strange homemade printed label, I guess, and a beat up old weed case, but it keeps getting all scratched up because I don't have the sleeve. We also picked up Mario Kart, complete in box. Mario Super Sluggers. This one cost $5 at a yard sale. I paid that. It also came with a brand new Mario Dance Dance Revolution remix. The Mario Mix pack from the GameCube, but just the dance mat. In box, though. We also got Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. We got Super Mario Galaxy complete in box. Super Mario Galaxy 2 complete in box. We play. Oh, dear. We play complete in box. Super Mario Galaxy 2 complete in box. Great condition. All of these games were in great condition. A lot of shovelware with it and just garbage games that I don't want, but all the heavy hitters I got close for free. We got a copy of We Play complete in box. Nice one to have. We've got Mario Power Tennis. This one feels light. I don't think this one's complete in box, no. But. Once again, great disc, great condition. We got Super Paper Mario. Unfortunately, it's a Nintendo Selects version, but we've got a, a manual and a good condition disc, and it's part of the Paper Mario series, so it's, it's always one to have. And that will be it for Wii stuff, for pickups. And finally, for this pickups of the past few months, I'm going to say spring, probably, for the title. We got a, a pink Game Boy Advance. Missing the back cover, I am going to look for one. But it turns on. Through batteries and it turns on. Speakers work. It seems to be like a dim screen. I don't know if that, I don't remember if that Game Boy Advances were backlit or not. Let me know in the comments. But great find. Paid a dollar for that. It's an AGB1, or yeah, 001 model. 
Not sure on the Game Boy Advances. I know the Advance SP, the 101s, I believe, are very valuable. But for the past few months, we've definitely done all right, considering all of this has cost maybe $50 at most. So that's it for the, uh, the game pickups for the first early months of 2017 and spring up until, I guess, the first half of the year, really. I haven't made a video yet. But as we always say, or I'm starting to say, keep hunting and your collection will grow. Have a good one.